there is a new emulation app on the iPhone called Delta that lets you play retro games on the iPhone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install this app. This is for education purposes only, so it's not up to me if you uh, decide to choose games that are not allowed. Um, but that being said, let's show you how to do it. So the app that you're looking for is called Delta Game Emulator. It is right now number one in the entertainment systems. So you just download that and it does not come with any games. So you're gonna need to download those separately. So this is a good website enabled to get ROMs. It's called emulatorgames.net and you can download ROMs to your favorite old games that aren't around anymore to play them on your iPhone. So you just select a game Let's choose Ocarina of Time. So you just click on that. There'll be a big save game button. So you click on that. There'll be an eight second countdown and then it will start downloading to your phone's file system. Just like that. So hit download and it will go to the download system. Okay, so in the Delta app, you just open that up and you'll see the games that you have. If you wanna add a new game, you just hit this plus button and you can save files, and you have to go back to wherever you saved it. So mine would be in the downloads folder, and the file should be something.zip, so whatever the game is, .zip. I usually just search for it, so you can select that, and then you say open. And there it is. And now it is running it on, pretending to be a Nintendo 64, I believe. And that's how you emulate games on your iPhone. Now, let's see how well it works on the iPad. Okay, so this is the view from the iPad. You can have it smaller, like it's a iPhone size, bigger for the iPad, and you can also rotate it so that it is the proper size. So no matter which way you wanna play it, you can do that. I will default to the bigger size. So let's add a game. open. There it is. You tap on that. And there it is, Nintendo 64. Zelda. So on the iPad, I don't see any, none of my keys. Oh, oh. I'm trying to see if my keys actually work. Can I click on anything? I can't click with the mouse. Does A, B, none of my keys seem to be working. Uh, I don't have my control, so I think I need to make it small and I might need to rotate it. Oh, there we go. So if you want to play on your iPad, uh, you may be uh, have a little bit more trouble, uh, you have to have it in this mode. If you make it full screen, oh, there we go. So it did get, so you can't, the, what, you can't have the controller at the bottom, obviously, and your keyboard does not work, but you can uh, maneuver just like that. I've got a privacy screen protector on this iPad, so that's why it's kind of hiding it. Cool. So yes, it does work on an iPad. Okay, a quick update. I was able to get some kind of control through the keyboard. I, I'm not a keyboard or a PC gamer, so I don't know if it's like A, D, X, like you can click some of these buttons and some things did happen. So I don't know what the keyboard commands are to play these things, but you can uh, kind of control it with the keyboard. Uh, but I would rather just play it handheld with the uh, with the iPad touchscreen itself. So just up to date, yes, you can kind of use the keyboard. And uh, yeah, so if you're a keyboard player, yeah, you can, apparently you can do that. So anyway, that is how you set up your games for the Delta emulator on the iPhone. This is going to be a cool new era of iPhone gaming now that iPhones allow emulators. So what is your favorite game that you'll be playing? Mario, Zelda, Bionicle,